These are two of the tuxedo males that we have at the Rifle Animal Shelter. This is Pacino, and Pacino came to us by a good Samaritan who was worried that uh, he was um, really, really cold and he'd been hanging around his house. We can tell he's a lost cat. He's so sweet. He's so nice. He uh, gets along great with all the cats in the cat room. He doesn't have any issues at all. Um, and he is available for adoption at the Rifle Animal Shelter. He is a very, very lovable cat. And probably, I think we only think he's around two or so. Um, and then, come here, Rifle Kitty. Come here. Come here, Rifle Kitty. <laughs> he's bidding <laughs> That's Rifle. Rifle um, loves, loves Pacino. And Rifle was a former feral cat, and it only took us about three years to turn him into a little fat love button. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here. Come here. And uh, there was a time when we couldn't even touch him, and now he is so lovable. See, he's got the little clip on the ear where they tipped it off. And he's actually lived here on our property for three years. And um, this past winter, we used to, we used to didn't really see him in the winter, but um, so many of us started feeding him wet food and stuff, and it, of course you can see food really brought him around. And he just kept hanging around the property. So this is the first winter we had to worry about him being cold, because he always just kind of took the winters off, or he'd come by every once in a while. But he started sticking around, so we brought him in, and I was really worried about it, and he took to this cat room so amazing and it didn't freak him out a bit in fact he became even more lovable so he reluctantly is available for adoption at the rifle animal shelter and you I pity the fool who adopts him because we really don't want to do it but we know we have to we know we have to. He just he needs a better life than this, and he he's just he's wonderful, and he's an awesome mouser, um, and he's just beautiful. I just love him so much, and it's gonna be a dark dark day around here when this little guy leaves, because he's been a part of our lives for a very very long time. Look at him, and we you can see we feed him very very well, but we we want the best for him. He deserves it. He's had a he's just had it so rough for so long and he got a taste of the good life. You want potty? And he likes it. Sorry. Wait, tell Mary this ain't no peep show. This ain't no peep show. <laughs> All right, we'll get him. And he does give love bites from time to time. But he does it so softly. And sometimes when you walk away from him, he's like, hey, hey, don't you walk away from me. <laughs> oh, kitty. All right, we'll get him. Huh? Yes, I love you so much. I do. I love you so so much. Come show Mary. Show him how pretty you are. Show him your belly. Show him that fat belly. See, look what Jackie's done to my belly. I used to have such a nice figure. And just to think, even a year ago this time we couldn't even touch him. We just feed him, and he'd be watching us, and we'd walk away, and then he'd come in. And now look at him. He's like, oh, I could get used to this. I could get used to this. <laughs>